Viola de More, a member of the viol family. Again, the viols are string instruments played with bows, but they have frets. They're actually members of the lute family. The Viola de More, a sort of intermediate-sized member of the family, the size of a viola, played by Garth Knox, and that piece called Malor Me Bat, Misfortune Batters Me. Before that, uh, Gerald Trimble played the viola de gamba, an uh, instrument that looks like a cello. And uh, we heard his piece, The Moor's Revenge. And when I say his piece, it's actually his medley of two pre-existing tunes, a, a Moorish piece from, from Spain in medieval times, and then uh, the thing that sounded like flamenco meets Celtic music was, in fact, a jig by the 16th, uh, the 17th century English composer Henry Purcell, uh, Mahler Mebat, the Garth Knox piece, based on some 14th century French music. So both of these musicians with their uh, old instruments, their Renaissance Baroque period instruments, are looking back to the music of, of that time period as well. In a moment, more from violist Jessica Meyer and cellist Zoe Keating as we continue with new sounds. These artichokes, we pack them in Tupperware, load them into our old Land Rover, and drive them over to the Solidarity Bridge, she says. It sits on a city sidewalk with a tidy little fence around it. Anyone can deposit food or help themselves. It's not just the news, it's your next conversation. Hear it on Morning Edition and be ready to make the most of your day. Listen every morning on WNYC. WNYC support comes from Workiva, creator of WDesk, helping Fortune 500 level companies with productivity, risk, and compliance with enterprise management solutions. Learn more at workiva.com. City National Bank Wealth Management, providing investment management, trust, and financial planning services to clients throughout New York. More information at cnb.com slash wealth. Check us out online to get your complete new sounds fix. Uh, all the shows are in our audio archives. You can hear any program anytime you like. The playlists will tell you what's on each episode of the show. And there's our free new sounds podcast that you can subscribe to or just view shows a la carte. And while you're there, connect with us via social media so we can keep you up to date on what we're doing here in the studio and with you sounds live, those concerts as they come up. In the background, a little more from uh, Gerald Trimble and his viola da gamba. And I mentioned at the beginning of the show that we first heard him back in the late 80s doing kind of Celtic-flavored folk music. This is an arrangement of the Black Nag, but in a an arrangement that has traveled pretty far from the Emerald Isle. Um, we might have time to hear a little bit of this at the end of the show, but I do want to get back to some of the more modern string instruments, the viola and the cello, both of them played in layers, respectively, by violist Jessica Meyer and cellist Zoe Keating. Jessica Meyer's piece is uh, a work called Getting Home, I Must Be. I, I suspect I should be saying that in Yoda's book, Getting Home, I Must Be. I'm not sure what's driving the, uh, the strange locution in the title there, but uh, it's all viola with a delay pedal. And then Zoe Keating from that album in which she layers up to 16 cellos, one atop the other. We'll hear a piece called Fern. Thank you. 